Goats are also gregarious in nature, which means they like to bunch together or follow each other. This can work to your advantage when you're trying to catch them in a pen or actually when you're trying to work with them and lead them around the ring. Goats are easily startled. When they are startled and try to flee, they might knock you over or they can often butt you with their heads as well. Goats' primary form of defense is using their head to butt. This might also knock you down or cause other bodily injury. Goats are tremendous jumpers, so you need to remember that as you bunch them into a corner. They have no weapons to fight with, so their instinct is to flee. Jumping over, through, or around you is the way they're going to get out of that situation. Goats are arguably the most sure-footed of all of our livestock species, so there's very little concern over most surfaces or flooring with their sure-footedness. Although we don't use halters in the ring, it is a good idea to start training your, your goat to lead by using a simple rope halter. Putting it on properly will ensure leverage and the proper amount of safety. But when we move into the show ring and further training, a simple neck chain is used to guide the animal and teach it to lead. Most goat chains have a piece of plastic to prevent pinch points and protect the exhibitor's hands when moving the goat. If your goat chain does not happen to have this, it's a good idea to either find another chain or put a piece of plastic tubing around it to protect your hand.